Yeah, I think big news today. Um, effectively, what it means is that uh, I'm going to concentrate where I think my real skill and experience and knowledge base uh, lives, and that is in the development of international events for V8 supercars. Uh, we've got a really interesting future ahead of us. Uh, as I think you know, we have the uh, FIA sanction to stage six international events, uh, and we intend to do just that. Uh, currently we are talking to a number of uh, locations around the world, all of whom are very interested in having V8 supercar races and uh, it's my role now to really concentrate on that and make sure that we uh, get them across the line in the, in the months to come. International director is a great role for me because uh, essentially that's where my skills are. I've come from a, an international motorsporting background um, and it gives me an opportunity not only to use my knowledge and experience in that field, but also the contacts that I have. Uh, and no doubt about it, having run uh, the circuit in Bahrain, for example, gives me a lot of understanding of how uh, not only a circuit, but perhaps more importantly, a country goes about staging an international event. So I think in that, in that sense, uh, this is going to be a great role for me. And, and I'm sure one where I can really bring a lot of my skills to the benefit and the, and the betterment and furtherment, if you like, of uh, the International Viet Supercar Championship. I think uh, in terms of more changes at V8 Supercars, it would be completely wrong of me to speculate on that. I think any changes that do take place are for the better of the sport and the better of the business going forward. Clearly there's a new board in place. We have now have, of course, a new commission in place. I think the structure's looking good. I think the future's looking good for V8 Supercars. Got a great platform and a great foundation on which to build. And I'm sure we're going to see some really interesting developments over the coming months. I think my time in, in the role of CEO has obviously been an extremely exciting one. I, uh, I've always had a great love for this championship. Uh, V8 Supercars is a, is a fantastic series. It has global recognition now. It is probably one of the top three championships in the world behind Formula One and NASCAR. It's got some iconic events and we've got Bathurst coming up. That's probably one of the top five races in the world. Um, it's just been a great experience for me to be CEO, CEO of V8 Supercars. Um, and I suppose what I've brought to the championship, well, certainly what I hope I've brought to the championship, is some real personal understanding, some per personal motivation for a lot of our team. We've got a, a fantastic staff at V8 Supercars, an amazing team of people who work their weekends and are straight back in there on a Monday morning working towards the next event. They're very passionate about what they do. And I hope the levels of communication have improved. Certainly, overall, in terms of the way in which the sport is now viewed, whether it's in the media or, more importantly, through television, I think we're looking great. We've got a fantastic audience worldwide into 500 million homes 139 countries frankly the sport's in great great shape and i look forward to being part of that as the, as as we go into the future uh, if i told you what the inter next international event was going to be i'd probably have to shoot you but uh now look there's I think it's well known that we're working, uh, we're working, obviously we're great to have got uh, the, the Austin, Texas race in the United States across the line. Uh, Abu Dhabi clearly is a, is a great feather in our cap. Uh, we're now looking at some of the more, uh, what I would call near Asian market uh, countries, such as the Philippines. There's been a lot of talk about the government support to go racing in the Philippines in the future. Uh, a lot of these will come together during the course of the next six months, I'm sure. And I think uh, whilst the 2012 championship will look not a lot different to the one that we're currently in in 2011, and I think 2013, with the introduction, of course, the added introduction, of course, of, of Car of the Future to the program, will be a very, very exciting calendar which features a number of uh, interesting uh, uh, international venues.